guys in today's video i want to talk about something that is quite important and something that uh, i see a lot of people actually making mistakes when people actually want to be successful in business and in other stuff okay um and it is probably going to talk to you because um for some reason maybe today in your business you are spending all your time actually reading your emails organizing your emails um you know really making sure that everything looks great uh, in that part that you take care of all your emails that you have nice notion templates to actually that you are really well organized with everything this is where i wanted to go that you are really well organized with everything that you are using all the latest software to do all this and uh still you are not getting the results that you need in your business because you are actually focusing on the wrong things this is what we are going to talk about in today's video and this is going to be a really important lesson in my opinion before we actually start I have a group mentorship program for Amazon FBA. At the time at which I am speaking right now, I still have some seats available, okay? When you watch this video, it may not be the case. So click the link in the description. You can actually get on the group mentorship program. It's $50 a month with weekly calls, okay? Weekly calls in small group, okay? Maximum 10 people. We have a group that I'm going to cap at five people right now that we are going, we are going to go above that soon. But um, yeah, this is what you, if you want to scale your Amazon business, do not get all the notions, those, those notions template, all those course on uh, productivity and all that stuff because this is some bullshit. Get on the mentorship program. This is all you're gonna get. Uh, all you're gonna get at best. All you are going to be able to uh, really build a successful business. You don't need all that bullshit. Okay. As well in the description, if you just want one-on-one -on -one coaching, it's more expensive, but <clears throat> it's going to be more efficient. You can book a one-on-one -on -one coaching call with me. There's also a link for this called Sora, and I have a free sourcing course. If you want to learn how to source products for Amazon FBA to sell on Amazon, I have a free sourcing course. It's uh, in the description as well. So let's just get into the video and let's just start. Uh, let me just start by saying this, okay? If you actually look at my text message inbox, if you actually look at my email inbox, at the number of like, you, you know, on, on iPhones, you have that, you have a, a number right next to to these things like missed calls, um, no, uh, unread emails, unread text message. I have probably like one thousand unread text message. I have probably like, I think I have like ninety thousand something unread emails. And I know some people are going to start to freak out when I'm saying this. But despite this, <clears throat> I'm not using Notion. And I, I really had the idea of making this video because, by the way, as you can see right now, I'm traveling. I'm not in my usual setup. I'm actually in my hotel room right now in an undisclosed location. I do not want to share where I am right now for multiple reasons. Um, but I really had this, uh, this idea why I was looking at um, some of my friends, um, not really a friend, but someone that I know, story on Instagram where I saw like, oh, they were well organized with, their, um, with some projects that they are currently running that is not actually that successful, okay? And, you know, you you, you got sold, the, the, the and especially in school, because in school, I was always the guy that was, uh, and not only in school, but just I was known as the guy that was not really well organized, all that stuff. Moreover, my end writing sucks, all that thing. And like, this is not like, you know, like people, people tend to think that I'm not that organized because for example, when I'm working, my desk is messy, all that stuff. But Albert Einstein himself said, um, if a clean desk is, um, it, 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 no, he's saying, if a messy desk is a sign of a messy spirit, what does an empty desk mean? So it's something like this. I, I may have phrased it wrong, but this is what he was saying. And basically, um, people tend, and especially in school and all that stuff, and I remember this is why I've always been good at school, but like I always... Like teachers always removed points from, from me, from, from, from my test and all that stuff. Because in Europe, we used to have to write a lot and we used to have to write all our lessons by hand. And no kids, you may not have to do this because you actually have laptop in school, so you may not write uh, as much as we, 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 as we used to. But the way my brain works and the way I actually organize things is way different. Like, I can, like you know, the way I, if I go back to my notes, if I go back, like, I know exactly what I'm doing. And... You know, I've always been labeled as that, as that kid that is not actually organized, all that stuff. But I graduated college summa cum laude, okay? Which, if you're in Europe, is like the highest dis distinction, okay? So I graduated, co I graduated college with the highest distinction, okay? So if I, and not only that, but <clears throat> I run a successful 
multiple six figure business okay on amazon and i'm able to start doing this channel and turning this channel into a business even though the channel is not huge yet but it's still growing at more than one like close to 120 subscribers a month and i've been able to make close to a full-time income with this channel okay which does not really have a lot of subscribers so if i really was that unorganized would i have been able to do those two things and these are not the only two business that i've started in my life that actually work that i actually uh, that i was actually able to make money but the reason why i'm actually telling you all this is because i've been able to do this without having a tight calendar like without having a calendar where i i have all my all my stuff actually um scheduled all the stuff that i need to do in a day if you actually look at my calendars the only thing that you're going to see in it is um birthdays for my friends and the people that i know that i have in my contacts and the flights that i'm taking that's the only thing that you're going to see in my calendar the only thing you will not see anything else in my calendar because i do not schedule my time like this and i know exactly from the top of my head what i'm going to do every single day okay same thing i do not use notions i do not use to do this i used to have to-do lists uh, just to have a list of websites that i need to check every single day but i do not use all those productivity acts to all those productivity acts my my email inbox is a mess uh my text message inbox is a mess and i'm still able to run this business more successfully than a lot of people that actually do all this bullshit because this is actually not what matters okay if you run an amazon business what matters is that you need to find profitable products buy those products send them to amazon that's the only thing that matters all that other bullshit does not matter okay if you run if you want to run a, a business on youtube if you want to be if you want to build your personal brand on youtube you just need to post videos and try to monetize and try to find a way to monetize it okay either by uh, affiliate links all that stuff that's all that matters you just need to at the end of the day you just need to post videos that's it and you guys focus on the wrong thing you want to post videos it's easy you just record yourself like i'm doing right now if you know your subject you just need to talk about it and that's it that's the only thing you guys focus on the wrong thing you don't you don't you do not need all those notions templates all that bullshit uh for 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 to 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 to, to actually be able to launch your podcast or whatever you do not need uh, a tightly kept email inbox to actually be to actually be able to have uh, a successful business this is just busy work that does not make money and that does not matter if you are spending one hour a day on your notion template actually trying to organize your stuff if you are spending um two hours a day or even five hours a week organizing your email inbox you are wasting time you do not need all that bullshit and worst case scenario if you really need to do it because you you are uh, uh, you you are uh, i forgot what it's called in english or you have ocds because of this just hire <coughs> <coughs> A virtual assistant to take care of all that bullshit for you. Three dollars an hour, outsource that to 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 the Philippines. Three dollars an hour, five hours a week, fifteen dollars. Go work at McDonald's for two hours and you'll make that money. So you profit off of that. Okay, you do not need to do all that bullshit. You are wasting time. You should focus on what actually is going to help you make money. That's it. You are focusing on the wrong things. Stop focusing on the wrong things. Focus on the things that are that is that are going to be helped. You. That are going to help you make money. I'm able to run those two business without doing all that shit while traveling. Right now, as you can see, I'm traveling right now. I'm able to do all this. And if if I really was unorganized, would I be able to do all this? No, but I do not focus on things that do not matter. I focus on things that actually makes me money. That's it. That's what you should do. Stop focusing on what does not matter. Okay? And try to think if you are actually taught the right way. Because you've probably been taught the wrong way, you know. All those, if you remember all those girls in, in, in your early days in school that were taking, like, that were keeping tightly, um, you know, like really nice notes with different colors, all that stuff, with stickers on their nose, all that stuff, all that bullshit. Where are they right now? They are working a job that sucks, okay? Because they need to do this shit to be able to, to so, so, you know, their boss actually have nicely formatted documents. That's the only thing. That's the only reason why you actually learn to do this at school. This is not what is going to help you make money. Okay? This is some bullshit ass. Uh, this, this is just some bullshit skills that you do not need. You do not need all those notions templates. You do not need to have nicely looking notes. Okay? If you really like... In, and if you look at my videos when I'm in the United States, all the things that I need for my business that I need to remember are just written down in... You know, I have a whiteboard right below, right, right behind me. In those videos when I'm in Miami, in my office. All the important information that I need to remember for the day or for the week or for the month are on that whiteboard. 
that's it. And if you look at it, it's not really like, it, it's not looking good. It's not looking like well presented, all that bullshit. It is not. But I'm able to run multiple six-figure business because of it, not multiple six-figure business, because the YouTube business is definitely not a six-figure business. Uh, but I'm able to make multiple six-figures a year, a year in revenue, six-figure in profit a year from my business all together without doing all this bullshit, okay? So try to think about what matters. Do the shit that you actually learned in school matters. Do that shit that do, 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 you, you do not need it. That's, that's just what I wanted to say. So um, yeah, do what matters. Make money this way. And uh, yeah, all that stuff that you actually learn is irrelevant in your quest to build a successful business. I hope this video was helpful. If it was, like, subscribe, do all that stuff. Uh, I hope the audio was good because I'm, I'm in my, my hotel room, by the way. And uh, yeah, I'll see you tomorrow for a new video on business or on Amazon. We'll see you all.